Hey y'all, welcome to Fresh Pit Farmhouse. Today's DIY is this beautiful burlap farmhouse welcome wreath. For this DIY, I picked up this metal wreath form from Dollar Tree, four rolls of this burlap ribbon from Hobby Lobby. Of course, I got it when it was 50% off. Leftover flowers and greenery from previous projects and this welcome sign that I also picked up at Hobby Lobby. So to start the wreath, you're just gonna make a loop. I start on the inside of the wreath form. Just place the loop through the opening and scrunch it up with your fingers. Make a half twist and repeat the same process just on the outside opening of the wreath form and scrunch that up with your fingers. I skip the middle. Make another half twist and take your burlap and just push it through the middle. So what this is doing is starting your pattern. I do like a zigzag pattern and just go back and forth. So I go to the outside, then to the inside, outside, inside, and so forth. And just continue to scrunch that up with your fingers as you go. So we are out here camping this weekend. We are at Kings Mountain State Park in South Carolina. It's a beautiful campground and a beautiful state park and it also uh, is next door to the Kings Mountain National Park. So it's a beautiful place to come. It's really close to our home so it's a great little weekend getaway. So you can see it starts to get full. So as you're making your little loops, you're just gonna fluff the ribbon and twist it. So some of your little ribbon folds will start to go in different directions. And that will make your burlap wreath look really full and really pretty. So after you're done, you can decorate it any way that you like. Again, I got this welcome sign from Hobby Lobby and I purchased this when the metal was 50% off. I think it was like $11.99, so I got it for around $6. So I just went around and put hot glue in certain places just to hot glue that to the burlap. And then I just took those leftover flowers and that greenery that I had from previous projects and just started gluing those on. I wanted it to have kind of a wildflower look, so I just sporadically glued flowers just until I thought it looked good. So this project was really easy and a lot of fun, and I can't wait to get it home and hang it on our front door. I am in love with how this burlap wreath turned out. I think it's gorgeous. Y'all will have to let me know what y'all think. And of course, subscribe for more DIYs. Thanks, y'all.